So when your doctor tells you that you need a scope or an EGD or a colonoscopy, what does that mean? Scope is a general term that's short for scopy, which refers to using a camera to look directly at an organ that we can't normally see. The ending scopy follows whatever the organ is. Colonoscopy is looking at the colon. Laryngoscopy is looking at the larynx. EGD stands for esophagogastroduodenoscopy, which is why GI doctors call it an EGD, because who wants to be saying that long word day in and day out? But what does that long word mean? It'll help if I explain each of the parts of the GI tract from when food enters your mouth until you poop it out. After food leaves your mouth, it goes into the esophagus or the food pipe. This connects your mouth to your stomach. After leaving the stomach, the food goes into the small intestine, which has three parts, duodenum, jejunum, ileum. After leaving the ileum, the food goes into the colon or large intestine. This has multiple parts as well, ending with the rectum and anus. EGD is looking at the esophagus, the stomach, gastric means stomach, and the duodenum. Why don't we look farther? Because the scope isn't long enough. We can't reach. So we can do a colonoscopy starting at the anus and rectum to look at the colon and the ileum. So that almost covers everything, but you might notice that the jejunum gets left out. We actually don't visualize the jejunum in a basic EGD and colonoscopy. 